Okay, what I'm gonna have to do is just, what, how? No, do not tell me. No. It's fucking, mm, it's fucking bendy is what it is. 100%. You gotta be shitting me, dude. There's no fucking way. There's no goddamn way. Ow. You can't tell me like, oh, there's no, it's a computer's pro. No, it's not a fucking computer problem. I don't understand how this game is eating away at OBS. Like, I don't have recording anymore, so like, fucking, I gotta replay this shit from beginning to end again. There's no fucking way. I refuse to believe it. Okay, anyway, where's this fucking spider thing at? Okay, now it's calming down. Oh boy, a boss fight! Uh, yeah, guys, it, it's, we might have to continue after the fucking fight if shit just goes sideways. That's my. It, it is what it is at this point. These motherfuckers do too much damage. Yeah, it's it's the game. It's 100% the game. There's a problem in the coding is what it is. I don't think it's well optimized. Now let me heal. Okay, that's the last heal. Oh boy, we did a thing three times twice and we won. Yay! Yeah, it's this air. It's it's the game. The the OBS might crash again because of how shittily optimized this is. Oh God. Okay, well, let's. Let's see if I can at least turn back on uh, source record. Maybe get some footage. Fucking maybe. Yeah, it's whatever. It's whatever. I'm not happy about it, but it is it is what it is. There's nothing I can do to change it. And this door's blocked. Oh, okay, never mind. There's a door behind us. Yeah, I don't know. I think it's like a... I think it's the ink textures. Like, I don't think those are textures. I think, like, those are, like, actual... Like, I don't know how they've built them, but something's up. I can't put my fucking finger on it, but something's going on. If I have to, I'll buy a second goddamn PC. Oh, she's scaled. Nobody cares. Okay. You just fought off a you just fought off a spider monster. Oh, hey, Bendy. What are you doing? What are you doing, little guy? Huh? What you doing? Yeah, there's there's too many there's too many technical issues here. Fuck you. Okay, I guess that's an interesting way to introduce a new enemy. Like, oh, look at all these eggs around. You have to beat the shit out of them before more little bad guys spawn. They probably like they're probably dependent on whether or not like you like run by them or something like that. That's probably what they do, right? Uh, anything else I need? Nope. Gent emergency shaft. Oh boy. Can't wait to see what's waiting on us down here. 
Oh god, I'm gonna turn around. Something's gonna be there. No, okay. Bro, I don't like this shit one bit. I believe there's something special in all Is that fucking no? Joey fucking Drew. Disney is alive. They unfroze him. I can't go that way. Oh, okay. Got to go up the ladder. Duh. Uh, any collectibles before we get this tour on the road, Joey? Oh my God! It fucking did it again. There you go. Follow me. But mind your step. This old place is full of surprises. Yeah, sure thing, Joey. I should know. I've worked here a long time. But we're in the Drew? Joey, please. Joey, what is this place? The studio, these monsters. Am I dreaming? It's a psycho, Audrey. An ink stained nightmare, forever stuck on repeat. With just a pencil and a dream, and with a little help from the Jet Corporation, it came into being. From what I gather, it exists in parallel with the outside world but completely removed from the march of time. And like a record played over and over again, it's begun to crumble, wear down. This studio is a monument to choosing the wrong road. Now, whether it was built for revenge or regret, I don't know. That's my riddle to solve. Okay. The truth is, Audrey, someone out there is messing with what's in here. Bad things have begun to emerge from the puddles. Wicked creatures that never came from my pen. The worst ones call themselves keepers. Dangerous, deadly folks. They've taken over the old jet workshop just beyond the sewers. Trying to bring what they call order to this world. Freezing the cycle in place. Changing the script. Whatever answers you're looking for. You'll find them there. All right, so now is a good time. Well, let me read that note and grab all these goodies. Every great story begins in mystery. Although things may be dark at the start, the truth will illuminate your way. Don't be afraid of who you are. Fear only what you may become and banish it away. Your best pal, probably Joey Drew. So one thing, sorry about burping. Um, one thing that I left out in the Bendy One review it, on purpose, intentionally, I was fully aware of it, was the cycle. So Henry, if you remember, when we finished the game, um, we walk through that door and it opens right back into Joey Drew Studios. Now, what does that mean? That means that he's in the cycle like Joey just explained, at least this version of Joey. And yeah, you, that's, that's it. That's what he experiences umpteenth time. So I don't, I forgot the exact number. Look, above all, never forget. You're here for a reason, Audrey. There's always a reason, even when you can't understand it. You made this world. Why can't you fix it? Because I'm not the man. I'm just a memory. Okay, so memory. So yeah, that's a scent. Oh. Okay, well, it's not ready for that, but it is what it is. Um, so yeah, so like, believe it or not, Joey Drew created this world as like a torture realm for like Henry because he blamed Henry for kind of what happened for the studio going downhill in a way. Don't ever lose hope. When in doubt, the answer you seek is usually nearby. We all have dreams, ghosts in our past, but those ghosts can give us a path forward. Your best pal, Joey Drew. Okay. He sounds like a very like inspirational version of Bendy. Don't run, don't run. Probably like I'm gonna catch up. 
Um, oh, hey, we're back here. Okay. Right? Or is this? No, this is different. This is definitely, this is definitely different. 100%. Ooh, do I have enough to upgrade the wrench or the pipes? Probably not. No. I really don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Oh, I don't care. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and... Ooh, do we want to pull a lever? No, ooh, we do want to charge our wrench up, however. We do want to do that. I don't... We don't need to watch every animation, do we? Do we? I don't think we do. Dream supply, nothing in there. Okay. Uh, I'm not going down there just yet. I'm gonna pull this lever first. Ooh. Nope, nothing there. Okay. So they at least guarantee you a battery, I guess? I don't fucking know. Okay, what do you do? Pull random lever. Or was that the other side of that room? I'm not sure entirely. Can I just walk off? No, of course not. Of course I can't do that. That makes too much sense. For this un unoptimized piece of garbage. Yeah, the room did fucking change, I think. Right? I don't know. Yeah, it did. Yeah, we came in here. Right? No, I don't know. I don't know anymore. Okay, so we got a little bit of exposition from joey drew himself so that's something i guess uh what's down this hallway also is the ghost like is she still in play or was she just like for that area just curious okay also i don't know what the point of having all these searchable lockers are if like hardly any of them have anything in them Okay, bacon soup. There's a sculpture. More bacon soup. More bacon soup. I'll save. Okay, so there's a hiding spot. So something tells me that the ink demon somewhere in here, or it can appear in here. Security override. Take your guy. You gotta follow your inspirations when you're a musician. Stick to what you know works. But when they built the new studio buildings, they all been filled in my office down in the old sewers. Turns out I've gotten so accustomed to working in those disgusting conditions. But now if my office doesn't stink, the lyrics I write do. So when Jen started digging their massive utility shaft between their place and ours, I knew it'd be just the right spot for me to move in. Now I've got a song in my heart and a creative stench of my uh, nose. Okay. Oh yeah, there's his hat. If you remember him from the first game. Pretty neat. If I do say so myself. Pretty neat. So we got one hiding spot there. I don't know. Yep. Good thing I fucking knew that was there. Yeah. Uh-huh. I wonder if he like just shows up randomly like in front of us. That would be cool at least, you know? See him creeping around or some shit. I don't know. Maintenance. There's a door there. Do we want to go in there? Okay, making sure no, neither of those are just opening. Okay, no, no that. Uh, oh, we gotta get over there. Okay, uh, let's go down this hallway first because it's probably not going to be friendly. Uh, anything in here? Oh, okay, the second security lock. Okay, that's cool. Come on, give me that. I don't have the crosshair turned on because, like, for screenshot purposes. Oh, there's a fucking upgrade tube thingamabob. Yes. What do we even want with this? Like, I th I'm thinking of like a health upgrade at this point, because like one running's useless. Permanently upgrade your ability cooldown. Eh, I think we just do health. I think we just do health. Because honestly, like. Cooldowns are not that useful. I hate to say it, but that's reality. Okay, I'm kind of waiting on Bendy to 
attempt to swing by again. Lord Amok rules. Lord Amok rules? I don't fucking know. Is that what we killed? Like this would this would have been much better if this was like leading up to the boss fight rather than oh hey here's a boss fight out of nowhere you know I don't know like I don't know like I don't know if I'm in a bad mood today or if I'm just like literally shitting on this game because I feel it deserves it but you know it's just one of them days where everyone sucks especially the people who made this fucking piece of shit. They designed this big tunnel to link their new gent building to Joey Drew Studios. They want to keep labor and parts flowing between them. I don't think they fully know what what they were what they was actually creating here, what they were actually creating. I, I don't know if they're like speaking with an accent or whatever. When workers are heading through the shaft, you gotta drain the center duct into the overflow. When they're gone, you flood it again. Any schmuck can do it, even if they're not an engineer. But the main thing is you gotta make sure all the duct hatches are all open. Once they're open, the overflow can go drain back and forth between the two ducts. It's simple stuff, but a bit complicated when you're working on it by yourself. Once you done, okay. Sure. Okay, I'm kind of just keeping my keeping an eye out for hiding spots. It's kind of like what I'm mainly doing right now. Because I don't I don't like how I don't I don't I don't like how Bendy operates in this. Oh, so that's probably opening that gate, right? Oh, I thought I was on a timer. Never mind. Herder. Uh. I'm waiting on fucking Bendy to show up again. He did it once. He might not because it's been a minute. Okay. So we go that way, I guess. Come on, Bendy, show up so I know your timer's at least reset. That or maybe he's not active in this area. Like, like right now, at least. There's that one. Is that it? Okay. I guess. So do I need to hit the other button? I'm sorry, I'm waiting on the Bendy thing to fucking catch up or whatever there's that there's that overflow so I probably got to go back to the second room or the first room rather and uh... oh come on get the fuck out of here oh we got mohawks we can probably do a little bit more damage than our counterparts get the fuck out of here Was this what we wanted to do? No. Wait, hold on. I think I gotta hit the button again. Maybe? I don't... I don't know. Okay. Hit that button again. Drain that, I guess. Really not entirely sure. There's another skip. I don't know why. It's fucking annoying. Okay, so all these dudes are gone. I need to find little vents over here to close. Unless they're like part of a gang or some shit. I don't know. Uh. Okay, do you open? No. Oh, fuck. No, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Yeah, I told you. I got... I didn't even get caught lacking. I just, like, fucking was just in a bad spot at a bad time. There was literally nothing I could do. Yeah. Like, there was nothing I could do. It was just... It was game over right there. The second, like, his shit started. Oh, come on! All the way back here? Uh, 
So that means we have to go and get that upgrade again. Oh, come on! Yeah, keep running, Bendy, you little shit. Am I frustrated a little bit? I'm sent back, not too far, but pretty far. It is what it is, though. Yeah, that's... It's not a good mechanic. It's just not a good mechanic. It's just not. It's an unfun mechanic. Fuck. Oh, yeah, I guess I'm going down. Oh, you're kind of, Man. I don't know. Like, I think I've said everything that needs to be said about this. Like, genuine. Actually, let me check something. Okay, yeah, I think we're good, maybe. Yeah, it just sucks I have to do all this over again. Like, what the fuck? Like, that's annoying. Oh, I, I get what I was supposed to do. I fucked that up, but still, like, that doesn't justify sending me all the way the fuck back. You know what I mean? Like, that doesn't justify that. We fucking return, do the pipe thing. Yeah. Bendy should be coming up soon, right? Yeah, this mechanic, sure. I feel like this should be like, I don't know. It's just all over the place, right? Like, I'm not the only one who thinks that. Like, everything's kind of all over the place and nothing's like, feels like fully thought out. That's just me though, and I'm an asshole. Like, like, that's literally what it feels like. It feels like everything's half-baked. Okay, I'm waiting on Bendy to spawn. Like, I have to, because if I go down there right now, I'm dead. Come on, Bendy. Let's see if I'm triggering the spawn like this. No? Come on, Bendy. Yeah, there they are. Uh, I don't want to go down there. I don't want to go down there. I guess I have to, huh? Okay, that was actually a lot faster than what I thought it would be. All right. Um, I'm waiting on him to spawn. It's literally all I'm doing. Because God forbid he fucking... Wait, can I just blink over there from here? Right? No, I can't. God damn it. Uh, I got, probably got to flip that lever again. But let me go get that upgrade. Back here because, you know, we got killed and we lost it because I got caught by Bendy. I could not avoid because, you know, I got to unlock the other security lock. That's so dumb. So dumb. Yeah, it was in that door, I think. I thought we pulled that one. <laughs> oh, I'm out of stamina. I'm out of stamina. Are you kidding me? No, don't do this to me. Ho, ho. Oh, got lucky. I got so fucking lucky. So lucky. So fucking lucky. Not even funny. You got to follow your inspiration. Uh. Stick to what you know works. But when they built the new studio buildings, they all but filled it by office down. So the, the fact that they come on. The fact that they have a Ever, ever present monster that can spawn in whenever he feels like it is not easy to balance and honestly they should have just scrapped that idea entirely i mean especially after the first game right like it, like that's how i feel about it at least they should have scrapped that after game one because if you have an all-powerful monster that can come out of nowhere you gotta have other ways to balance balance it other than hiding 
you know, and when you're in active combat, you can't hide anyway. You know what I mean? I'm going to save really quick. Okay, there we go. Okay, so what were we doing? We're going this way, right? No, we were going this way. And then we're pressing the button. We're going to the other side. And then, yeah. And then I think I jump on the one platform and blink from it. Yeah, I think. Hold on, I'm gonna save really quick. Again. Am I going? Am I getting in the safe scum territory? That could be argued. Argued. Uh, argued. Uh, uh, fucking stupid here. Okay, something open. I don't know what. Uh. Oh, do I go in there? Maybe no. What do I do? Okay, well that's better than nothing. What the fuck? Okay, I'm here. All right. Uh, where where were we? Hmm. Going in through here, right? I think yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, guys. Uh, let's see here. So, we flipped the switch. What did the switch do? Let's see if... Oh, wait, yeah, it opened up... It opened that tunnel up. That's what it did. Uh... Oh, come on! Don't worry, guys. The game... The game's sure to keep giving me obstacles i need a fucking vending machine i also think i have enough tools for an upgrade which is the heavy attack oh, come on this is the shit i don't like because this is just padding oh she disappeared or she went to the other hallway one of the two, I don't care. She probably went to the hallway. Okay, can I get some, like, health items or something, please? Something useful, instead of whatever the fuck all this is? Within our isolated walls, Lord Amuk reigns. The drips and drops from the leaking world above cannot stop his rule. Those who oppose a mock's hand, a muck's hand, a mock, whatever, have their bodies crushed and fed into the narrow pipes that lead below into forgotten sewers under our feet. Those tunnels are even bigger, even darker than this one. There is only suffering down there. But should anyone defeat Lord Amok, cast him down, our small kingdom will belong to the Conqueror. This is the secret of Amok's immortality. Pass on the throne, pass on the name. Okay, so literally anybody can be Lord Amok. Okay. For those of you watching live, it is greatly appreciated that you are